Hey guys in this video we're gonna be checking out the top 5 best spiralizers, that are available on the market for their true quality. I made this list based in my personal opinion and hours of research and have listed them based on popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinions and more, if you want to see more information in the updated price you can check out the description below and also make sure subscribe for more reviews ok so let's get started with the video. Starting at number 5, we have the important features to consider. The handheld spiralizer is a great gadget if you have limited kitchen storage. Its compact design makes it easy to fit into a drawer. The handheld works well for soft vegetables, but you need a lot of hand and wrist strength to twist sturdier vegetables through. We tested two of Amazon's best rated handheld spiralizers, Vegeti and OXO Good Grips. The Vegeti is one of the as seen on TV products and is very inexpensive. The OXO handheld is nearly triple the price, and although it's well made, like the Vegeti, it took elbow grease to work. The countertop spiralizers are much easier to use, but because of their size, they do require cabinet space. We tested five countertop models, and although we had varying results, we did like their features, strong suction cups to hold the spiralizer to the counter, heavy-duty construction and a crank handle made churning the vegetables a breeze. The countertop spiralizers are not much more expensive than the OXO handheld. In fact, they often cost about the same. So to get the most out of your money, we recommend a countertop model. Moving on at number 4, we have the Blade Tabletop Spiralizer. The OXO Good Grips 3 Blade Tabletop Spiralizer is our top pick for the best countertop spiralizer. As with many OXO products, it's thoughtfully designed, well-constructed and very user-friendly. The OXO tabletop is almost identical in shape and appearance to the other spiralizers we tested, but it's substantially sturdier and can process hard vegetables as handily as soft vegetables and fruits. At number 3, we have the Briefton's BR5B02. The Briefton's BR5B02 5-blade spiralizer is a well-made, efficient and user-friendly spiralizer with many of the same features as the OXO tabletop. It's equipped with five stainless steel blades in slightly varying sizes, 2mm for angel hair vegetable pasta, 3mm for spaghetti, 5mm for fettuccine, 5.5mm for curly fries and a flat blade for ribbons. The noodle shapes from these blades aren't really different enough to warrant five blades, and we found that the 3mm, 5mm and flat blades did the job. However, you might want to have the two extra blades on hand in case a blade wears out over time. At number 2, we have the OXO 3 blade handheld. If you lack storage space, or if you're just cooking a small amount of vegetables, then you might want a handheld spiralizer instead of a countertop model. We tested the OXO Good Grips 3 blade handheld spiralizer and the Vegeti, and without question, the OXO handheld is a far superior product. The OXO handheld is a cleverly designed, compact cylinder, 3 inches in diameter, made of heavy-duty plastic, with three color-coded blades that fit snugly on top of each other. The pronged disc that is used to push vegetables through the blades serves as the spiralizer's cap when you're storing it away in a kitchen drawer. Similar to the OXO tabletop spiralizer, the handheld has blades for thin noodles, green blade, thick noodles, orange blade, and ribbon cut, green blade. The vegetable sits on top of the blade's core, and you turn the vegetable clockwise while pressing down on the pronged cap. The length of the vegetable noodles depends on how you cut the vegetable. And finally at number 1, we have the other products we tested. Kinsey manufactures a line of lifestyle products, such as exercise accessories, water bottles and bathroom scales. The Tri-Blade Vegetable and Fruit Spiralizer is its only kitchen product. It's composed of lightweight plastic, and as some reviewers point out, resembles a child's toy. It has three stainless steel blades for thin, thick and ribbon noodles, two of which are stored inside the spiralizer's chassis. The third is exposed but locked in place in the upper part of the body. We found this to be a common flaw in other spiralizers. You could easily cut yourself on the exposed blade when removing it from storage. Four half-dollar-sized suction cups hold the Kinsey securely in place, 
and although the unit didn't move while we were spiralizing, the blades rocked up and down as we were feeding through the butternut squash and carrot. The Kinsey cut the sweet potato and pear into even, long strands. The zucchini came out as long strands and short half-moon-shaped pieces. However, all of the blades failed in cutting the carrot and butternut squash, which emerged coarsely shredded or ground up into bits. Thanks you for watching guys, I hope you liked this video if this video is helpful to you. Please make sure like comment and subscribe, if you have any question related to this product you can leave a comment down below. I will get back to you as soon as possible.